The life of Frederick Douglass takes center stage. With words from his own speeches and an incredible soundtrack, American Prophet is now playing at Arena Stage. Tommy McFly joins us with Cornelia Smith Jr., who plays Douglas in the scene. You know, it's Frederick Douglass, so to be able to play such a character who is really a part of the fabric of American history, it's really, it's really been a joy and an honor. Very well, very well thought out. The world premiere of American Prophet, focusing on Frederick Douglass's life, his journey, and his wife, Anna. When we think about Frederick Douglass, what comes to mind is the older statesman with the white hair, you know, Frederick Douglass, that, that image that a lot of us have. But we're actually focused on right when he was kind of this young man, really in this pivotal point of unearthing who we know him as today, this great kind of prophet, this great abolitionist, this great um, leader and fighter for freedom. Not the gentle shower that we need, but thunder. I just think that it's really powerful that um, his presence and his work, his words still live and resonate with us individually and throughout culture and society. Do you think now more than ever, Broadway and theater are sort of substituting as our history teachers? You know, Hamilton kind of kicked the door open of you could have a great time and learn history. And is this where you see Broadway and theater going as also sort of helping people with like their civic responsibility? Wow, that's a really interesting and, and great point. I think so. The beautiful thing about theater and just entertaining is when you can have the best of both worlds, where you can go and be entertained, but also actually learn something that you didn't know before. What is the thing you learned about Frederick Douglass that you're telling everybody at a cocktail party? You know, he traveled the world giving speeches. And just when I say that statement right there, he traveled the world, period. And so to be able to travel the world in that time, that's just a lot of time and commitment on the road. We're also telling the story of Anna Douglas, um, his first wife. And she's not really mentioned in the history books, but she was a huge part of his life, a huge kind of, like without Anna, there would be no Frederick. With the scene, Tommy McFly, News 4.